Imagine wearing a pair of glasses that can see what you see, hear what you hear, and think faster than you can type. No. This ISNT, a sci-fi movie, it, s Google, s Bold New, step into the future. At their latest I.O. event, Google revealed something that could reshape how we interact with technology forever, Android XR. The company's first platform built specifically for smart glasses and headsets. But what really makes this groundbreaking is the brain behind it, Gemini. Google's most advanced artificial intelligence model yet. Together, Android XR and Gemini promise to merge AI with reality in ways we've only dreamed about. These aren't prototypes for a distant future. Yes. They're already being tested in the real world. An early demo suggests Google might be pulling off one of the biggest comebacks in tech history. The same company that gave us the awkward, doomed Google Glass a decade ago is now back with something sleeker, smarter, and actually practical. And the best part, it's designed not to replace your world but to enhance it. For years, tech companies have been chasing the dream of wearable computers, devices so natural and seamless that they disappear into everyday life. Meta has its Ray-Ban smart glasses. Apple is rumored to be developing its own eyewear. And Samsung has its upcoming XR headset. The race to own your face is heating up fast. But Google's playing a very different game this time. They're not trying to trap you inside a digital metaverse. They're trying to build something that helps you in the real world. Picture this. You're walking through a busy city in another country, a street sign pops up in a language you can't read, and instantly your glasses translate it for you. You glance at a painting in a museum, ask who created this, and the answer appears right in front of your eyes. Or maybe you're lost, and instead of pulling out your phone, an arrow simply appears in your vision, showing you exactly where to go. No distractions, no fumbling, just seamless assistance. The timing for smart glasses couldn't be better. 10 years ago, People weren't ready to walk around with cameras on their faces. Now, almost everyone carries a phone that records 4K video and responds to voice commands. The world has changed, and this time, Google knows it. What makes these new glasses stand out is their design. Gone are the bulky frames and weird side pods that made the original Google Glass look like something out of a bad sci-fi flick. These new prototypes look stylish, understated, and surprisingly normal. Every bit of tech, from the microphone to the speaker to the camera, is hidden neatly inside the temples. Even the small recording button is tucked near the hinge, blending right in. The display sits in the right lens, visible only to you. So whatever information Gemini provides remains private. And because the glasses connect to your phone through Wi-Fi or Bluetooth, all the heavy computing happens elsewhere, keeping them lightweight and cool. That's a huge deal. Overheating and short battery life are what killed most early attempts at smart glasses. Google also learned from its privacy mistakes. Remember the backlash when people realized Google Glass users could record them without knowing? This time, a small LED light turns on any time the camera is active, signaling that you're recording. It's a simple fix, but an essential one, and to make sure these glasses don't scream gadget. Google is collaborating with major eyewear brands like Warby Parker and Gentle Monster. So yes, this time you can actually look good while wearing the future. The real magic, though happens when you see what these glasses can do. During the live demo, Google showed Gemini's ability to recognize the world around you. You can look at a building and ask, what's that place? And it'll tell you the name, history, reviews, and more, all projected subtly on your lens. Need directions? Instead of shouting in your ear, an arrow appears in your view, turning as you move. Look down, and a small map appears. Look up, and it disappears. That's what makes this feel so natural. It's context-aware. It reacts to your surroundings, not just your voice. And the translation feature... Mind-blowing? Two people speaking different languages could carry on a live conversation while their glasses displayed real-time subtitles. Sure, the demo froze once or twice, but the concept worked, and that's huge. Imagine doing business overseas or traveling without language barriers. These glasses don't try to pull you out of reality. They quietly add intelligence to it. 